Right now at 10, do you really know your neighbors? A Sussex man arrested after the bomb squad pulled two homemade bombs out of his home today. It was quite a scene in a quiet neighborhood. The bomb squad, the feds, even a bomb robot. Some neighbors had to evacuate their homes. Annie Schultz has been live on scene all afternoon. What's the latest, Annie? Well, I can tell you a 20 year old man is in custody, and authorities believe the devices they found in his home here posed a real and credible threat. Now, tonight, the only lights in the area are holiday lights, but this investigation is far from over as authorities try to figure out just what this man had in mind. Two explosive devices found in a Sussex home neutralized by the Milwaukee County Bomb Squad. The devices that we found, um, according to the bomb squad, were devices that were explosive in nature. Inspector Eric Severson with the Waukesha County Sheriff's Department says this all started Wednesday with a tip that a man living in this apartment complex was making bombs in his home. They arrested him and went to work. Ishana Rousey lives in the complex and was kept away when she came home from school. Well, they told us that we can go back there and um, I just went, so I just went to a friend's. One of her friends, Nathan Blair's bus, was stopped by an officer who hopped on and asked everyone who lived on the street to get off. Creepy. Yeah, yeah. Not what you expect when you no. come home from school, right? No, not at all. Once Nathan got home, his parents were keeping a close eye on the situation. My wife sat there and watched the television, you know, and gave us reports <laughs> as I set out here to watch any activity. Activity that, even after all this, isn't over yet. While we've, we've ascertained that the uh, residence doesn't contain any more dangerous devices, we still have to search for other evidence. And authorities are not releasing this man's name yet because he has not been charged. That could happen as early as tomorrow. For now, he is in custody and answering a lot of questions. Live in Sussex, Annie Scholes, today's TMJ4. Yeah, sounds like we'll have more answers tomorrow as well. Thanks, Annie.